All right, we have things are currently unresolved. Okay, so this is solemn, 7326. My flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. So basically, even if our flesh, our heart, or our spirit grow weak or fail, God is still forever our strength. This means that even if our body will be struck with the worst diseases, or if our heart gets broken over and over again, or we are crushed in spirit and see no hope, God will forever be our strength and forever be our comfort. So um, things are unresolved. Things are not over with the situation. This may be with a lover, with this King of Cups temperance coming out as a dominant energy and kindred partnership. What is this? Yeah, this is, uh, to me, all this is about love. You guys may be renewing your relationship or the relationship moving to uh, um, a new level. You may, you guys, you guys may, may be flirting or some kind of intuitive communication, telepathic communication, someone expressing love, new love. Some of you guys could have kids together. Okay, strength, reverse, speaking of. That's what we just went over in that scripture. Mm -hmm. Something new. Ace of Pentacles. Three of Wands reverse, yeah. Someone's going to return or you're going to return back to something. Somebody was hoping that you guys were going to be um, weak and went over, be able to overcome something. Possibly trying to create delays, blockages, setbacks for you guys and your guys' love. Or didn't want things to be resolved. Okay, whoever that is, is stressed, restless, four swords reversed, or in bad health, bad mental health. They possibly, yeah, they're not sleeping well at night. The moon, four swords reversed. They may have wanted you guys to be in bad health or in bad mental health and not be able to get out of that. They could have wanted you guys confused or been feeling in the dark. I was looking at this um, Eight of Wands. There's like, I'm going to cover these girls up, but there's like this dark little thing coming out of the water. It's like a dark entity or something coming out of the water. Uh oh. <laughs> the Moon, Eight of Wands. So. There's a breakthrough. You guys may receive communication or you guys may talk soon about something. This could be somebody trying to travel towards you to message you or something. Ten of Swords. Yeah, there's a phone there. This person's holding a phone. So... They could have wanted somebody to be feeling insecure, timid to talk to you or to communicate to you. I feel like the plan was to have you guys sever ties, or have you guys confused about something or some kind of illusions. Could have been doing magic, mirror magic, moon magic or something. They wanted y'all confused. Five of Cups. Someone said about this Ace of Pentacles. Oh, it's a karmic. Queen of Pentacles reverse. This person that's jealous. Devil reversed. They don't got no control. They're stressing them out. 
when I'm looking at this devil card on this particular um, deck, I keep hearing Baphomet. Baphomet. They're evil or some dark stuff. Or they work with dark energies or something. Page of Swords Reverse. Yeah. This is underneath the moon. So something was going on behind the scenes or secretly or spiritually. Possibly um, some kind of deception, manipulation, lies, possibly mental magic. This Nine of Swords is trying to pop out. Things are currently unresolved and now someone else is stressed about this. So basically you all have unfinished business and someone plans on returning or communicating to you or going towards you. Yeah, what a miracle. It's some kind of miracle. They're stressed out. Like how the they're like, how the heck did you survive all that? Good juju. You survived it because of some good juju. Maybe you was praying or something. I see some crystals here. You was doing um, some kind of prayers or something. You was doing something. Good juju. This person... Um, you just been doing some kind of something to help you cleanse, it looks like. To help you let go, go with the flow so you can receive this love. You've been in this temperance energy. Maybe reading something. What else with this karmic? They have an unhealthy, strong drive for power or control. Somebody was playing somebody the whole time. This could be something about someone's friend. I want you in my mouth. Okay, um, what else? I miss having sex with you. So... Somebody may want somebody may want to do um, oral sex or something. Um, they were holding on way too tight. Somebody wants to have sex with someone or this person is about to be rushing towards you to have sex. Um, or y'all are gonna have sex today or what? <laughs> um, what else? These are getting stuck. Expect a romantic gesture soon. That's a page of cups. You moved on from this friend, but they still haven't moved on. So you moved on from somebody. They're sad. They can't get you to crumble or fold. So, yeah, there's going to be some sexual stuff there for somebody. Okay. You may, some of y'all may be waiting to have sex. Um, or some um, oral sex, 69. Unhealthy, strong drive for power. Some karmic, stress, restless. Knight of Swords. They're angry and stuff. Um, Hierophant, Page of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, Reversed. They know somebody's going to be given to an Empress or something's balancing out for an Empress after they try to have things off balance for you. <clears throat> this person may be getting ready to communicate something. This may be 
very hostile, aggressive communication. Someone's in a rush or something. There's anger because they couldn't stop you guys from um, being invested into each other. They wasted their time. Things are unresolved. You guys are still going to work things out or get back together or something like that or get married or settle down. They wanted things off balance for an emperor too. Damn. So basically they wanted things off balance for you and your twin basically. I'm hearing they didn't want you guys to forgive each other. They wanted like you guys to hold a grudge and um, have a lack of forgiveness. Can't get you to crumble or fold. Two of pentacles. They may be trying to get two people to do this. It's not working. Eight of pentacles reversed. They may be trying to affect somebody's income or their job or something. They can't. Knight of Wands, yeah, Four of Pentacles. They're upset because um, they could be selling a home or something. Um, they're upset because things are in balance for you with this Two of Pentacles. Knight of Wands. There's, yeah, this sexual, passionate type of chem. This could be a fire sign. All this passion between you guys. It's like your guys' connection is unbreakable. They can't they can't stop this person from being attracted to you. Yeah, King of Wands. They can't stop a masculine from being attracted to somebody. He's about to resolve things between you guys. Or this is you, the King of Wands, about to resolve things. Somebody is <laughs> somebody is ready to have sex. I miss having sex with you. They try to cause confusion or some kind of lies and it's not working. They could be wanting somebody's mind to be confused or something or to not think straight or some cognitive issues or not know the answers, not know the truth. It keeps that. It's like it keeps failing. This person still feeling they still have the discipline. I keep hearing this person's abstinent. Somebody's abstinent. Yeah, they they're still a strong drive to go towards you or something. And sever ties with this karmic. So some of y'all expect a romantic gesture soon from your twin flame. Temperance and the star. These are both very spiritual healing energies. This could be a, um, some kind of spiritual communication or intuitive communication. Something at a spiritual level. Peace. Peace. Peace of mind. That's what I'm hearing. Peace of mind. Peace of mind. 